This segment of Panther Sports Talk is brought to you by Agape Therapy. The UNI Men's Basketball Program established itself as the top program in the state of Iowa in 2004 when the Panthers won the conference tournament and qualified for the first of five NCAA tournament appearances. Two of those student athletes that helped Northern Iowa turn the corner are back on the UNI bench as Chris Foster is the team video coordinator and Eric Crawford is an assistant coach. Brad Wells looks at why Crawford is happy to be back right here at UNI. Scoring over 900 points in his career, UNI assistant coach Eric Crawford was part of UNI basketball when it turned into a consistent NCAA tournament team. Crawford played a bulk of the minutes in the NCAA tournament games against Georgia Tech, Wisconsin, and Georgetown when UNI went back to back to back into the NCAA tournament. I mean, that's where the passion comes from, there's no question. Uh, Coach McDermott, Coach Jacobson, um, you know, Coach Green and P.J. Hogan, all those guys were part of it at the start. And uh, it's to be a part of that first group that made it to the tournament is something that's special and it's something that, that's made it, been a bond for us. Um, you know, coming back to homecoming, there was four or five guys from those teams that were back, and we all had the same pride. Um, in large part because of that, we see the success in the Sweet 16s, the five tournaments, um, and we, are, we feel like we're a big part of that. While his playing days called the Unidome home for the men's basketball team, Crawford will now be coaching in a different arena. But it's the support of the community and the university that has stayed constant since he left. Just the community. The community, um, the university, everyone's been great. Uh, Exactly the same way it was when I left. People have always supported our program. Um, They believe in what we're doing and they believe in the players, believe in the coaches. you know, when you walk around the community, you can just you can just feel how how passionate people are. And the way the programs were built, the success that was built that we're enjoying today was built with alums who came back to coach, and to have to have Eric, who was really here during Max time when the program had its its renovation, if you will, and now come back to be a part of the coaching staff. It it says a lot about you and I as an institution that the alums want to come back and want to contribute to to ongoing success. You know just how much support that we've always had and that, that hasn't uh, hasn't changed at all. And that's that's the biggest thing about being back. And it's also you know having a chance to work with the players. Um, I'm as passionate about this place as anyone you'll find, and um, in large parts because of the success that we've had and some of the tradition that's been built here. That tradition was built and continues to grow at you and I with the same style of player as Eric Crawford. For the most part, all guys that, that were really you know, under the radar guys and we all meshed together. We had the same chip and the same drive and um, we're really to get things started. And I think um, what we've seen over the last you know, eight, nine years is that same mold of player hasn't changed. And you look at what Jake has built here even after Mac, that is the formula. Hard nose, competitor, uh, work hard, ethic, that's that's what Eric brings, and, and so he's going to be a great fit. It's a, it was a perfect complement to the to the staff that Jake's put together. I've heard a lot a lot of stories about him being here, a hard worker, um, a great player, and uh, you know working out with him this year, he, he's he's shown me a lot, and uh, we're very lucky to have him here. <laughs> 